Hi, boys and girls. It's time for the children's sermon. So come closer, come closer to the TV or your computer so we can all talk. Today, Pastor Susan is going to read scripture and preach a sermon about words spoken by a prophet, a wise person who lived many years ago named Jeremiah. And Jeremiah said, it's important to follow the rules, but the most important rule is what's on your heart. You know, since we've been stuck inside, my family has been playing a ton of games. We play games like Monopoly or um, Connect Four. We play card games. We even play Trouble and Sorry and Candyland. Have you played any of those games? Well, I have to tell you a little bit of a secret. When I play Monopoly, sometimes I get frustrated. You know, when you play Monopoly, I like to be the little iron. You roll the dice and I move my little iron however many places the dice says to move. And once I land, I'm never sure quite what to do because there's so many rules in Monopoly. So my family has to look up in the rule book, okay, here's what you're allowed to do here. I think about it and I make my decision and then it's the next person's turn. And sometimes I don't even have fun because we spend so much time trying to figure out the exact rules. Sometimes I get so frustrated that I stomp off and say, I don't want to play this game anyway. It's too hard. Well, what's the point of playing a game if you're not going to have fun? Which is why I love Candyland. In Candyland, I pick up a little piece of paper and it has a color on it. And then I just move my guy to that color. And sometimes I'm going through the land of candy canes. Sometimes I'm in the gumdrop forest, or I can land and take a shortcut over a rainbow. Every once in a while I get stuck on a piece of licorice and lose a turn or two, but that doesn't last long. And you just keep moving forward until you get to the end. There's so few rules in Candyland that it's easy to have fun. Well, the same is true in life. When you read what God has told us to do, you can spend so much time following every single rule that you lose the joy of life. That's not what God wants for us. And so the prophet Jeremiah is saying, listen, don't spend all your time looking up the exact rules that are written down because God has put the law, has put the rules on your heart. So listen to what your heart is telling you to do. My heart, when I'm listening to God, tells me to be kind, to be a helper, like the many medical people are being helpers now, to be faithful, and do what I said I was going to do, to be loving. And so I hope that you'll understand that God wants you to follow your heart and not get stuck in all the many rules, but to remember that because God loves you, your job is to love other people. Will you pray with me? Dear God, Thank you for games. Thank you for giving us people to love. And thank you for the easy rules to follow. Like loving one another, being kind, and forgiving. In the name of Jesus Christ we pray. Amen. Thank you, boys and girls. I'll see you again next week.